Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperial Galactic Survival. Uh, let's just jump right in here. Um, so last episode you saw me get most of my base up and running. And what I did off camera is I finished that off. I sealed it in. Um, I went out and mined. I, I mined out each type of deposit. So one of each type of deposit, I mined it right out. Uh, so we, we now have a whole bunch of resources and I picked a bunch of, um, fiber and kind of flew all over the place, discovered a bunch of POIs. I never actually went and checked any out. I just discovered them because we can go check those out, uh, on camera. And now that I got a whole bunch of resources, so you can see, here's the base here. It's all sealed in. I'm 22 degrees. In here, I'm not going to bother oxygenating it because what's the point? It's on a Kua, right? You don't need to. It's just a waste. Okay, so today, um, oh, and I built this little room here off the side. I call it my wet room or my uh, wet generator room. I'm also going to be putting my regular generators in here too and fuel tanks. So this will be like the noisy wet room you can you also notice that it's sealed in here and i have water in here so and dirt um it's really easy you just dig right under and run blocks under and then seal it up i mean not a big deal i pulled up some more dirt because there was only a little bit over there so i pulled some up over into the corner so that i can put my wet generators down so that's what i'm going to do right now i also had a whole bunch of hv parts cooking because that's what I want to do today. I want to trick out the HV. You can see I've got all this stuff going. Well, there, that's some SV parts preemptively. I started making, I'm like, oh, wait, I need to upgrade the HV. So uh, you can see our ore is just over the top now. We've got stacks of ore of each type. So, except for obviously, so stacks of Prometheum, iron, cobalt, and, or not cobalt, but uh, copper and silicone. Uh, cobalt, I'm still really low on, and I'm 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 kind of really relying on the on the uh, base attack drones and stuff right now to supply me with all that cobalt gear. Um, and I shot down a bunch of stuff. So the moral of the story is I rose to eleventh level. I've unlocked a bunch of stuff, mostly the HV stuff, to trick it out. Okay. Let's get this stuff down. Um, my wet generators, I got fuel here. So let's put these wet gens down. I call them wet generators because they need water to run. So, well, they need to be in water to run. Sorry. Okay. I really desperately need the water one right now. Um, although that's not the one that I'm going to be using all the time. So let's, uh, I'm going to be actually accessing the hydrogen ones more than anything, to tell you the truth. So I can clip it. See, it'll allow me to clip into my base, which is kind of trippy, but um, you know what? I will. It doesn't matter. It's not going to fly off anywhere. So I'm just going to fill that right up. We'll get that going. We'll get the oxygen going here. Let's um, let's tip that on its end. And we'll spin it around. Make it face the water generator. And we'll can we get it to yep right there. See, I don't really care if it clips into my base because it doesn't really affect anything. And we'll get that going. Okay, eighty percent. See, it's full source quality. Oh base attack drones okay well those are brewing up I'm gonna go grab the parts here from those drones because we really need them okay I gotta put lights on this and everything because that it's really pain in the ass to drive at night but and you can see it's it's pretty much flat all the way to these to these drones now so I, I built my base in the right location pretty much that's what that comes down to okay so jump 
out. Let's turn some lights on, at least in here. Doesn't really mean anything. We just do a quick, quick little jump. Come on, try again. Quick little jump. Get, come on. Really? Quick little jump. Oh, quick. <laughs> oh, why did I keep doing that? Come on. Come on. little jump. There we go. <laughs> get those parts. Yummy, yummy. And go get the other ones. Not the fridge. I want to... Uh, there we go. So you can see I sealed off my HV. Um, so that's awesome. Now, did I do that last episode? I can't remember now. But anyway, it's sealed now. Okay. Jump out. this. Yeah, so it's the, the uh, energy matrix, or power matrix, or whatever the hell they're called. Energy matrix, I think. Um, and the cobalt alloy is the two big things looted from the drones right now at this stage. Because I can't actually mine cobalt, so uh, these drones are a good way to get those parts. Okay. Back to the base. Yeah, it's really dark. I gotta put lights on this thing. The sun's gonna come out in a few minutes anyway. Okay, I just wanted to grab those parts. Uh, we'll get this right in the middle of our bay here. And we'll just turn it off. Jump out. And come on. Jump out. Yeah, uh oh <laughs> and smash my face, yep. <laughs> okay. Uh, I put a medical um, station down so that uh, I can spawn there and heal up. I took a little bit of damage from one of the critters while I was out uh, picking fiber. Okay, uh, parts. Let's put the parts in here. And... Really should get the. I, I need more energy here. Let's get some larger fuel packs going. That'll make the um, those wet generators run faster or run longer, I should say. Okay, so let's start tricking out the HV. Uh, we're gonna need these. Um, don't need those. Don't need that. Don't need. Uh, we. Maybe some cargo. Okay, this was actually for upstairs. This is for upstairs. Let me put this in the... I'll just um, throw it in this cargo box here for now. Okay. I just want a bunch of space on me here for... Uh, no, there's nothing up here that I'm going to use for blocks, is there? Uh, okay, there's small ones there. I'll grab those. And that looks like it. Okay. Okay. So let's grab the rest of these. We'll grab the hover booster, the spotlights, bigger thrusters, cargo box for harvest. We got five drill modules made. I'm going to put a mini turret on. I'm going to need another generator, a couple more fuel tanks, four more RCS, and a couple hundred more blocks. So this should get us. Ideal, I'm going to put the four pontoons, the larger ones, sticking out a little further here. That should stabilize it. Uh, I'm going to cover them up. And that'll give us some platforms to put maybe uh, more turrets on later on. But um, And I'm also going to knock all this front stuff off and put drills in here. So let's do that. Let's start by popping blocks off. I'm going to disassemble because I want the blocks back. And so I want to do one. Two, three there. So let's get those down here and installed. So I'm going to go, come on, like that. And that. And that. Okay, oh, I should drone this up. It's much easier to construct with a drone. Okay, um, now what I want to do is I want to, well, I guess I could put, where's the other one going to go? I should put it like 
here. And then the other ones I'm going to put off to the side, I think. But i got to build that out more, so we'll do that after I put more blocks on. So let's grab some blocks. We'll get these, uh, I'm going to call them pontoons, but they're the other hover, the larger hovers on. So I want this to come out, and then we'll put the that style on. Not spin. There we go. And yeah, we'll go like that. And I could use a symmetric t tool, but I'm not going to bother. I don't think it's big enough built to warrant. Um, and then I want to come out with those. So we're going to go like this and continue that out. One, two, three. Okay, so now I got a little cradle to put the hovers on. And oh, I guess I got to make another drill too. That's okay. We'll uh, take care of that later. Okay, so I'm going to put one right there. Uh, and then I'm going to cover that with blocks. Now, should I round them up there? Now let's just do the square for now. This is going to be a fast, dirty build. It's not going to be pretty, but now I could do, should I angle this up there? Yeah, let's, let's go like this. We'll take that off and we'll put the round slope ones on so we'll go like this and then actually I want to just continue that so I'm gonna go like this and then same thing here we'll just go like that and really I mean at this point I'm just gonna fill this in with blocks so we'll just go like this. Okay. So that's one pontoon done. Okay. Let's get the other side done here. So that was, it starts at the end of the drill base. Okay. So let's get this on here. And that'll be one, two, three, four. And then we can even just do that already. Okay. And then one, two, and then we're going to flip this like this. And that comes out four. And then put that there. And then we get the regular blocks now and so regular blocks there and we put the the hover in come on come on you, come on really there we go oh come on there we go <laughs> sometimes it can be really difficult to to put these blocks in i don't know why but Okay, so let's uh, we'll just um, fill this in. And no, Ugh, it's going to place a block there. Come on. What? Ugh, annoying. Come on. Thank you. Okay. Uh, so. Actually, that's. I want a block there anyway, by the look of it. <laughs> okay. Um, and actually, let's put one in there. Tuck that in. Okay. Uh, I'm probably going to need them there, too, then. There. And. 
Oh, wait, no, I need the curved up. I should do the curved up to match. So now I gotta get, hmm, not so easy to get down to that block. Okay, I gotta be, stop it. It's really, uh, okay, steel block, yep, okay, good. So I wanna do the curve up on them. And it's that one. Come on. Like that. And come on. The drone is really touchy here. Come on. Get in there. Right there. There we go. Okay. Okay, so that's the front pontoons. Let's do the back ones. Um... So really, I'm just going to do the same thing here. Pull this out four. And then we're going to rotate this. And we're going to pull this to four again. And then uh, it's going to be two blocks. One, two. So I can't put that in yet. I need to. Um, okay, so let's put thrusters in. And we'll do it right like that and that. Okay, and then now I should be able to put these blocks in. Put those back over here. Okay, and then we're just going to put regular blocks there. One, two, and then here we can do the curve up. Okay, and like that, we'll pull that across, and then we put that, flip it, put that like that, and we'll just fill that in with blocks. I know it's covering a thruster, but it's one of the smaller thrusters, and I'm going to have better side thrusters here. Uh, okay, so now we should be able to put this in. like right there, and then we cover this in with blocks. So like that, 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 there, and come on, there, okay. So that's that back pontoon. We'll get the other one done here. So that was, there's gonna be two blocks here. And then there's going to be the rounded slopes here. So we pull that out four, one, two, three, four. And then we flip it. Nope. Come on. One more. There we go. And pull that out. Uh, and then right here, we're going to do the same thing over this side. And flip it. Okay, and we'll just put the blocks in. And the last hover, right there. And we'll fill that with blocks. Okay. Okay. So there's the hover pontoons. Uh, that really widens it out, I know. But it's going to make it way more stable. Trust me. Okay, so now um, let's get some RCSs in there. Because you can never over RCS a hover. I, I want to stress that. Um, Obviously, you get it to the point where it doesn't make any more difference, then, you know, <laughs> don't put any more on then. But, uh, okay, so let's, yeah, let's just get these in here. Sure, we'll put another one there. Okay, so there's the RCSs, and then we want, uh, we should probably put the side thrusters on now. 
and we're going to put those fuel tanks and the generator. Uh, so yeah, let's do let's do this, and we get these side thrusters in. So what I what I plan on doing is I'm just going to lay these down. Come on, like this, and come on, and here. And you notice that I still have three blocks sticking out there. The the proper width for a uh, turret. Just in, if if I ever decide to put turrets here, which I may. Okay, so this, and come on, there, and then we'll do the front ones just like here. We'll just like there and. Right there. Okay, so there's the thrusters. That should give us plenty of thrust um, lateral, forward, and back. Um, forward is very important, actually, especially on drilling hovers. Now, this is going to be a bit of a pain in the ass drilling with this thing with these wide pontoons, but what I want to do is We'll, we'll figure that out in a bit. i got to build another drill. Okay, so let's keep getting this parts in. So I need this generator in. Um, so if I... What if I go like this and lay it down? And... Actually, you know what? I should just... I should go like maybe just... One, two, and stand them up. Yeah, I'll do, I'll do, no, that won't work. Um, hmm, how should I do this? Uh, I've got the armor locker in there already. I've got everything in here except for these couple items. So, I don't really want them on the side so much. I was just going to leave most of that kind of exposed a bit. Mm. You know what? Okay, let's let's stand it up. We'll just install it. Okay, come on. Install it there. We'll get the fuel tank, at least one of them in, right here. Just, um, hmm. I wonder if I if I put one there. If I just cover it up. Yeah, let's let's do it. And I'm just gonna flip this. Oops, like this. And then we got a spot there for something. Uh, what can we put there? Oh, we've got our cargo box, our harvest cargo box. So let's okay. So let's put the harvest cargo box over here then. Come on, come on, right there. And then we'll put the we'll put a regular cargo box here so we'll just put a regular cargo box in there okay okay it should be we should probably oh actually let's put some lights on really quick and um hmm how do I want to do these lights So, let's, okay, let's put blocks here. I'm going to do it a little bit different this time. I'm going to slope, do a couple of, some slope ones right off the front. Uh, oops. So we're going to do like this, and we'll go, uh, do I need the slope? You know what? I'm just going to do, yeah, I do want, I do want the slope, because I'm going to show you what I'm going to do here. So I'm going to do slope, um, flip that like that, and I might have to adjust those to face it, um, Oh wait, that's the wrong one. I need the horizontal one to, to, to point straight. So, 
we're going to pop that off and then do this again we'll use the horizontal one right there and then um, and then I want to put blocks so f let's go like this and this here and here and then we're gonna go we're just gonna do some slopes there 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 that okay add a little bit more protection to the cab uh, okay and then we wanted to I go like this or how do I put that drill out now so sh should I oh let's build another one and then because I can put six on so let's 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 do six The only drawback to doing that is they do consume energy 100 kilowatts and that's another one of the big concerns why I wanted to put another fuel tank in too okay so let's uh, get this popped in And we're going to put this looking right there. And the other one here. Okay. We'll put that like there. So that widens it out a bit. Um, that should give us a pretty good array. Okay, so I need to get some blocks on here. So let's just, um, how are we gonna do this? Should we do slopes coming down? Let's see. Yeah, let's go like this. And then, I guess just regular blocks here. We'll just fill this right in. Let's go like this. Because I can access everything from from inside, from the control panel, right? So, and then do we want to elevate the... Yeah, we kind of do because we don't want those blocks getting shot up. So, let's go. Hmm. Do I want blocks there or do I want to go like this? Um, one higher. Yeah. Okay, so let's do that. <clears throat> keep my eye on the, the radar so we're gonna go we're gonna put some regular blocks in here okay and then we're gonna go sloped here and then okay and then we're gonna slope it here. Oops. Come on. There we go. Like that. And hmm. That's a little awkward there. So I'm gonna pop those other blocks off too. Come on. Stop it. Spin. Thank you. And Wow, it's really not wanting to place that. 
right there okay and then so that's three blocks okay and then we I, I guess we'll just pop this off don't see them yet I don't hear my turret shooting oh and that's another thing I gotta check on my ammo for that so let's go like this put some regular blocks in there and there and then we want regular blocks I know it really heightens the HV but that's just the way it is so we'll put put some regular blocks there it's going to be a long flat and eventually I can put like a drill turret off the back facing down okay and then we'll put these in so let's rotate that to like that. Oh wait, that kind of looks stupid, doesn't it? Now yeah, let's just do it on the front ones then. Okay. And okay. And then we just do regular slopes right there like that. Yeah. So let's pop that off and I don't know where the drones are yet they're taking their sweet time aren't they and like that okay well it doesn't look like a hover box so much anymore but I don't like some of the stuff exposed so we're gonna we're gonna go like 25 points Let's make some really abrupt contours with this. There's my, my base shooting up the drones. And we'll collect those parts in a second here. We just want to put... Let's just... Uh, let's go like this. And I guess what I could have done is... is um, put an angle one there and put like but you know what I'm just gonna just for some dramatic effect I guess let's uh, get this come on there and there and there and there we'll just drag that down whoops whoa drag it down to there okay it's ugly as sin we can maybe we'll paint it up later um, and I can't really protect that much we could put some blocks on the front you know what let's not worry about that right now let's just go jump in it give it a quick test run while we go get the whoa 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 come on come on jump it in it oh my god <laughs> suck at jumping okay and then jump in and then let's power it up and woof let's fill all okay we got enough now good uh, let's fire it up uses 20% of the two generators okay uh, looks like we're only gonna get a couple hours out of out of it running which is not the greatest but not the worst it's because of these drills on it right now. Okay, so let's hover up to three and let's see how this thing flies. So, fairly responsive. You can see I can make it jump all on its own. Just, oh, my video is trying to catch up, sorry. Oh, it's really super smooth. Really super smooth. It flies like a dream. Okay, good. So, we'll go like this, and we're gonna just do a quick little jump, pop out to get our drone going. And bullets, that's okay. That's okay. Um, I could put the turret on right now, but I'm not gonna bother, because I wanna do that inside while I can uh, adjust it before it starts firing at everything. Okay, let's go get this. 
is one of those evil raptors. Evil. Well, they're aggressive. Okay, and then we just jump our head out, peek our head out, pop our drone, and collect these goodies. Nice. And we're off to the races. Now, was that the one that I just looted? I think it was. Now I don't know. Or is that the one? Maybe. I don't know. Let's see. And just quickly jump out. Whoa, I jumped too high. It got the attention of that guy. But he can't do anything about it. Ha ha. Ha ha. Haha! Uh -huh. And now he's LOS'd and he's broke my. Uh, I'm no longer aggroed onto him, and I've already done that one, so. Yeah, derp a derp. Okay. Let's go get the other one then. So that must be on the other side of here. Must be this one that I need to loot. Okay, and then do a quick little jump and don't fall. See that? He just ints those spots and see how fast they run? They are crazy. Akua is really difficult because of that. Those stupid aggressive. And yeah, nice. He had some good goodies on him. Okay. So let's head back to the base. So let's. Well, we can, we can like buzz around a bit here. Uh, we could even test the drilling out. Yeah, let's test the drilling out. Uh, I got the harvest box in there, so we'll just, let's um, point down and we can start drilling. And then I'll lower the hover height just so it's a little bit more stable. Put it down to about one and a half. And I want to make it big enough all the way around. I don't want to just create a hole that I can't get out of. And you can see we're getting ridiculous amounts of crushed stone. And I'm trying to get down to the... and I'm stuck. So we back out a bit. Widen this off. And the one problem now with the HV drilling these things is you get so much crushed stone, it's ridiculous. Like it's just, it's too much. Okay, so I got a good chunk of iron off that one, and you gotta get these. Can't wait for the laser drills. I, I have a feeling they'll do a much better job with these things. And I am getting a lot of iron though. I mean, it's working, it's working. I'm not complaining, it's working. It gets to him fast. Faster than the uh, faster than the T2 drill. Oh yeah, but by the way, I forgot to mention I did I already made a T2 drill. You might have noticed it in my uh Okay, let's O and try and get Come on. Ugh, I'm kinda stuck right now. Come on. And O no, oh, it's not helping, so let's try digging, and I'm stuck, really? Okay, come on, come on, aim up, okay, oh, oh, and dig at the same time as hitting oh, that can help, and twist to the side, come on, you can do it, you can do it, try and go back, and wiggle around, uh, this thing's really wide. It's not. It's not ideal. This is not ideal. Okay. So, although here we go. I'm spinning around. Here we go. Here we go. I just got stuck for a second, right? So, and why did it switch me to? It's auto adjusting my view and forcing me to go into first person. Why? So, get that, and so, okay, it works. It was actually pretty quick. We did get, other than me getting stuck, uh, because this isn't really, 
ideal for that. I think uh, I think one of those uh, drill turrets might be really good for deposits now. So you just park right over top of it and drill down to each little thing. I think that's going to be the way to go now. Uh, the drills on the front here will be good for meters. Meters that fall, it's it, it'll be really good for that. So, so that'll be my goal, getting... Um, we made pretty short work of that, though. Let's take a look to see what we actually got out of it. I mean, we got one, almost one and a half stacks in that just couple minutes. So you can see uh, gathering resources is, is super easy now. Okay, we're not going to the drone base. We're not going to the drone base. We're going to my base. Okay, come on, get out of the way. And I just like completely smooth right over all this stuff. Not a big deal. The bumps, nothing. So let's let's try out the how it does on train. I'm not going to touch the mouse. I'm just going to push forward. Okay, the drills are obviously in the way, but let's see if it capsizes. Just and oh, abandon mine. Hey. Nice. Well, wow, lots of... I never went this way, obviously, before. I'm discovering tons of stuff. And... Nice. There's the abandoned mine. There's no... No dudes. So that's something we can explore, too. And... Oh, there's a village over there. Um... A village. Hmm, that'll have good loot. That'll have really good loot. And it just, this thing is awesome now. Look at this. It's just no problem. And it just corrects itself when it starts tipping over. Yeah, this thing's, this thing's great now. Oh, it handles like a dream. Well, I would say the test so far on the HV is very successful. So, so let's head back to base. Okay. Hi. Hi, I'm going to come take your, all your stuff in a bit. Oh, a nice area to, uh, of rock quarry. This is this will have tons of aloe, fiber, and the rocks themselves have a really good potential of uh, dropping cobalt. So I'm going to have to come back here. And this was due west of my base. So, you know what? Let's, uh, let's do that next episode. We'll head back to base and we'll call it. And uh, yeah, this is really good so far. So we're gonna go, we're gonna go POI looting next time. Um, so kind of, kind of exciting, uh, way more exciting. I think this this time around it was a little bit more exciting than just drilling too. So I like tricking out the HV. It didn't take much to do, uh, and now it handles awesome. It's gonna use up a lot more power. Uh, but I'm going to spin up a bunch of uh, energy here and um, and get it all ready. I'll put the drill on. I'll get a bunch more. Um, here, let's just drop. I'll put a bunch more of the um, bullets into it and we'll... Oh, you know what? I never checked the alignment of the, the lights. Uh, I can do that later. I can do that later. We're, we're pretty much out of time here. So if you guys like this episode, like and subscribe. And next time we're going to go uh, steal a bunch of alien stuff. Yeah, we're just going to take it from them. We're just going to be bullies and we're just going to go take their stuff. And it's going to be good. It's going to be good times. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed yourselves. Uh, I will see you on the ep next episode. Ciao for now.